Hello everybody, it's FlySwata PowerPoint Animator 214 here and welcome to my fir very first unboxing. And today we're gonna be going to a full review of Monopoly the Mega Edition unboxing and review. I got this uh, quite a while ago uh, at about 2.58pm. Uh, it's very unusual that I got this earlier today, today and it was supposed to be that I should get this on uh, Monday. But I'm finally glad it's finally here, and here and here it is. So uh, here, here we have the the, uh, the uh, front box here, and it, it is the uh, U.S. edition. U.S. edition because it's uh, very obvious. It's the uh, U.S. edition. So uh, classic gameplay and and more. And here's the front part of the box. It's really big. It's it's a really big box than my other. Uh, uh, sets of Monopoly. It's a really big and much uh, thicker box, and uh, you can own more nine additional uh, property space on the board. You can now build more skyscrapers and depots, and they add an additional one thousand dollar bill in this game. And they also had, and they also add the yeah, bus ticket card, which you can see right over there. Sorry about that stupid glare. As you can see right there. This is for ages 8 and up, 45 to 60 minutes, 2 to 8 players. And play faster with the speed die. And this is my uh, second uh, Monopoly version with the speed die into it because my first one was my Monopoly 2013 edition, which was the UK version. So here's the front part of the box, and you can see the board. The board is going to be a lot bigger in this game, so that's why it's called the Monopoly the Mega Edition. And I got this uh, from Am from uh, Amazon for uh, for thirty dollars, would include thirty dollars and uh, fifty nine cents for included uh, Prime Global shipping, so which should cost more than about a total of sixty dollars. It's quite a little bit expensive. So yeah, there's the front part of the box, and now let's take a look at the back part of the box. So here's the back part of the box, and as you can see, the Monopoly board is quite big, bigger, and it's and it adds a lot of new spaces on the board. The game board is about 50% larger than the regular game board. Added more property spaces, and there's the con the contents of it. Game board: 32 houses and 12 hotels. We got eight skyscrapers, four train depots, tokens, 37 title deed cards, 16. Chance cards, 16 community chess cards, 16 bus tickets, 3 dice, 2 standard dice, and 1 speed die, a pack of money, a banker's tray, and an illustrated rules. And you can see there, own more. The massive game board has 12 more spaces, including 9 additional properties. Build, build more. Build houses and hotels, and keep going by building skyscrapers to earn mega rents. You can even build train depots on the railroads. Get richer. Start the game with $2,500, including a $1,000 bill. Play faster. Speed die and bus tickets makes the action fast and intense. Play an entire game in 90 minutes or less. It's quite a bit exciting. We're gonna be playing this. We're gonna be playing this g game later tonight, and I'm quite excited to play this game later today. So that's the back of the box. I'm gonna show you a bit of a comparison to the houses and hotels for on my uh, Monopoly 2013 one, and also the speed die, which is which is uh, a little bit blue, which I really don't like, but I think it's okay. I think blue is uh, very uh, very fits with this game. So uh, give me a minute here. So I'm just gonna take the cellophane off this. All right. We got the cellophane off here. So now let's take off the lid. It's gonna be quite difficult to uh, open this box with one lid, so with one hand. Sorry. Ooh, this is gonna be quite exciting. Okay, take off the uh, lid here, and I'm quite disappointed. It's a little bit, it's a little bit uh, dent over there, but I think it's okay. It's only the uh, lid of the box. So. So what's inside here? We got the uh, we got the rule book of the game. It's pretty black and white, but it's it's kind of it's a little bit standard though. 
in my uh, Monopoly Disney one, it, it, it is not black and white, but uh, some of the, the versions of Monopoly have a black and white rule for this game, but I think it's okay. Houses and Hotels, rule book. This is the rule book of the game, pretty standard, black and white. There's the game board. I'll get these, get these out of, and I'll get these out of them, these. These items out of the box. Okay, board in a minute. Oh, everything is uh, everything is kind of a bit messed up here, so I'll get to I'll be able to deal with it. Your your standard tokens of the game, pretty standard. I'm just I'm gonna open these later and I'm gonna show you them all. I'm gonna show you all of them. We have your chance cards. Focus. Yeah, pretty standard. And here are your hotels and and skyscrapers. And there's the uh, speed die. As you can see right there, speed die is blue, like that. Uh, I'm quite disappointed that the uh, speed die is blue in this game. It kind of sucks. It really, it, it would be nice if it was red in this version. Um. One thing I do notice that uh, I hate what uh, the uh, the uh, wrap of these cards are separate. I wish I could have done. We I wish they could have done it in a one plastic wrap, so I can just uh, open them up easily. So yeah, quite disappointed what they choose. So I'll be able to deal with it. <laughs> uh, here are your bus tickets, which are new in this game. I'll be showing them. Community chess, quite standard too. Get out of jail free. Okay, here are your houses and train depots. And your two standard dice there. What's the last two? Properties. The properties in this game, ooh, it looks pretty awesome actually. And of course, the money. I like the thousand, the thousand dollar bill, which is new. One thousand dollar bill, which is quite new in this game. It's not that many though, which I'm quite disappointed. But, but some of the denominations here that you can see in this, in this, in this plastic wrap are basically the same. And I like how the pla pla this tray have have these ones, the number. The number trade ones you can uh, easily put them e you can put them easily 1500 150 20 10 5 and 1s you can't quite you can't quite actually see it but uh, I think it's okay I don't think there's something here, underneath here nope it's okay okay now let's get on to the board okay the, here's the uh, game board it's quite big and here's the original game board. I'll compare it. It's the uh, I have the uh, UK version. Uh, sorry, I I don't have the US version, sadly. So I'm just gonna compare it with the UK version. But as you can see, it's a lot bigger than the regular game board. Yeah, it's a lot bigger. It's a lot bigger, and it, it and it also includes a lot of properties on the game board. So I'll be showing them in 360, so I'm just gonna go with it. So let's see. We're gonna start off with Go, as always, collect $200 salary as you pass Go. Mediterranean Avenue, this is the US version by the way, because I got this, I got this uh, US version on Amazon. So, yeah. Community Chest, Baltic Avenue, new one, Arctic Avenue. Income tax, pay $200. Reading Railroad, Massachusetts, Oriental Avenue. Chance, New One Gas Company, Vermont Avenue, Connecticut Avenue, Just Visiting Jail. Next to Just Visiting Jail, auction any unowned property. If not, move to the highest rent. Maryland Avenue, St. Charles Place, Electric Company, States Avenue, Virginia Avenue. Pennsylvania Railroad, St. James Place, Community Chess, 
Tennessee Avenue, New York Avenue, New Jersey Avenue, and free parking. Next to free parking, Kentucky Avenue, Tants, Indiana Avenue, Illinois Avenue, Michigan Avenue, bus ticket, I'll get to that later, b &O Railroad, Atlantic Avenue, Ventnor Avenue, Waterworks, Arvin Gar Gardens, California, and as always, go to jail. Next to go to jail, we have Pacific Avenue. We're now into the expensive side of the board now. South Carolina Avenue, North Carolina Avenue, Community Chest, Pennsylvania Avenue, Short Line, Chance, Birthday Gift, take $100 or a bus ticket, Florida Avenue, Park Place, Luxury Tax, pay $100, and boardwalk the most expensive one here are the uh, houses the train depots skyscrapers and hotels here's the here's the hotel comparing to the uh, 2013 one the this one is a little bit darker than the uh, 2013 one the, this one is a little bit lighter shade it's a lighter shade of red as you can see right here and this one it's a little bit of a darker shade of red as you can see right there those are the hotels and we're gonna compare the house next it's almost the exact same color as the uh, the Monopoly Mega 2010 one it's, it's a little bit of a darker shade of green right here and this one it's a little bit lighter not really much the uh, same color as the ones right there here we have the uh, train depots which you can pay, play on the railroads and you don't have to own all the railroads in order to buy train depots and you can and these cost a hundred dollars these are cost a hundred dollars to pay what it does it doubles the rent on the above shown on the card so i'll show the cards in just a bit and here are the skyscrapers looks quite awesome and i and i like it Pretty damn epic skyscraper, and I never played the Monopoly Mega Edition, so this is my first time playing it later tonight. So it's gonna be epic, actually. So we, here we have your standard two white dice. It's a lot bigger. It's a it's a lot bigger. And again, and, and again, comparing it to the uh, 2013 one, it's a lot smaller than the 2000 the 2013 one. But this one, these dice is a lot bigger probably probably to match the size of the speed die right here here's the comparison with the 2010 one and the 2013 one they're the same size but what the only difference is they are in different colors though which kind of sucks i really miss the red one you know i wish they could have done it red instead of the this color right here but i but i think it's okay to me anyway fit the actual uh, to fit the actual color of the uh, box in this game and here are the uh, 10 pieces in the in this game and they are these some of these are classic actually so we so here they are top hat race car my favorite one of the game battleship cannon the money bag some of these tokens are uh, are just the same as my other monopoly sets but some of these are are the are in the uh, Monopoly 2001 UK version, which I have in my collection. The thimble, thimble is already out actually, so it's too long to him. Once again, wheelbarrow, he's gone actually too. Cavalry rider, uh, dog, and the boot or shoe. Three, uh, three of these guys are out actually. So yeah, so, so long to them. Okay, that's the tokens. Now let's get on to the cards. Here are your chance and community chess cards. I'm not gonna open one of these actually. Actually, I'm just gonna keep this on the plastic because they're they're just basically the same. Same, but these are just the 2010 background design of it. It's like in the uh, 2000 uh, 2007 one. Should be the same. Advance the boardwalk one. 
Okay, those are the chance and community chess cards, and now let's get on to the properties. And here are your property cards. It's basically uh, it's basically a standard uh, property cards, as you can see right as you can see right here. It's basically a standard Monopoly cards. So uh, here is the uh, rent payments, and there's and that's the mortgage side that I showed you a while ago. Place basically standard Florida Avenue. Arctic, the new one. Sorry, you can't you can't really see. Pacific, North Carolina, South Carolina, Pennsylvania. These are all U.S. standard Monopoly, so they're just it's just basically the same as the original one. So those are the property cards. Now let's show you the bus tickets. And here are the bus tickets, and uh, in, and uh, you guys already know these already, so I'm just gonna keep this in the plastic. Some of these guys already know. What the bus ticket does. They're not basically the same actually. Some of them are the same but but some of them had 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 said uh, expired them. All but all all except this one expire so I don't know. I can't recall what it is, but uh, I can't recall what it say the expire one, but uh, it's basically basically some of them are the same. Same uh, information what it says on the back some of them expired now the last thing I'm gonna show you is the uh, is the, mo is the money I'm gonna keep this also in the plastic for a while now so here's the uh, one thousand dollar thousand dollar bill the new one in this game which is the only higher denomination in this game everything else everything else in, you can see in this pack standard monopoly denominations no matter what design you're gonna be playing with. oh yeah I forgot to mention that at, uh, that uh, that I hadn't I didn't compare this a while ago it's basically the same size as the uh, as a standard monopoly property card so it's basically the same size so you get the idea you get the idea of it so here's the 2013 one and here's well here's the uh, 2010 one it's pretty standard anyway so sorry about that and that's it, so that's my full review of Monopoly the Mega Edition. Sorry I couldn't really, I, I really couldn't say uh, full, I really did say full review but I didn't say full review while clapping in the video. So sorry about that Nardinia, I can't do it. I can't really do it while my cam, while my, while I'm holding the uh, camera right here. While I'm recording it, so, so, so I'm sorry about that Nardinia, really sorry. Sorry about that. I think you're, I think you may not gonna be liking this video. So anyway, guys, thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to leave a like, comment, and subscribe to my channel for more videos. And I would like you guys, thank you so much for reaching my channel, 140,000 total views. Insane amount of views, guys. We're almost at 150,000 total views. Thank you guys so much for supporting me and uh, for supporting me for my to my channel for the, for the past three almost for the past three years and uh, yeah and almost thank you guys for almost nearly 530 sub subscribers to my channel. Thank you guys so much. It's been a long it's it's really really a long uh, Monopoly review video actually it's it's uh, almost 19 minutes now. Anyway guys, thank you guys for watching. Really, uh, really unusual that uh, I got this, got this from Amazon today for over thirty dollars, dollars, or should I say, total amount of sixty dollars because it includes shipping, thirty dollars, and it includes shipping. So yeah, thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Peace out, lads. One, two,